What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Uh, today we're going to do a quick, just a quick video. It's going to be kind of a quick project. It's something easy that you guys can do if you want. Um, we're going to put some LED strips in the footwells to provide some lighting. And I'm going to wire it to the uh, dome lights in the truck. So anytime you pull the door handle and open the door, the dome lights come on and then the lighting in the footwell area will light up. Um, just provides extra light so you can see. I had it in my last truck and it was pretty useful. Um, there's times like at night when you're looking for something in your car, it just provides a bunch of extra light. Um, so I got this kit from Adrenaline Off-Road. And this is the kit. It's all wired together. Basically, you've got the controller box right here positive and negative wire and then it goes to two LED strips more wire the other two LED strips um, so it should be relatively easy uh, let's take a look I'll show you guys what the plan is I'm probably not gonna film the whole thing I'll just kind of run these and then show you however I wired everything up um, but basically what I think I'm going to do is run one side of these up, um, up in here and over to the other side. And then the first one I'll just zip tie somewhere up here and then I'll tuck the wire under here and then bring the second one you gotta excuse the uh, big mess. The dog uh, likes to make a big mess. But I'll run the other one. I have to clear that out. Basically what I'm gonna do is run the other one back here and then under the seat. And I'll just zip tie it up under the seat, but towards the back right here. Pointing the light kind of down towards the feet area of the back. So, um, yeah. Like I said, should be a fairly easy project. Hardest part's gonna be fishing the wire up over there. But even that's not that hard. So let me do that, um, get everything in place. I'll show you where I put everything. Um, I'll show you how I wired everything up and then we'll test it. All right, I'm gonna just give you a quick uh, update. I'm still running the stuff, but just wanted to show you guys real quick. Um, so I've got the uh, one of the sides routed up and over. I'll go to the other side. So that one comes in. Let me drop this down just a little bit. So that comes in from here, and then. I ran, you can see the strip here, I just zip tied it as best I could up here, out of the way, and then I ran the cord back over here, down, and it's running to the back, and I tucked it right up under the seat right here, um, but I made sure to go over the track so you don't run it over. So that one goes over this track right here, comes out in the middle, and here's the other one. I just gotta get this zip tied up under here, tuck the wires up, and then do the same thing for the other side. And after that, just wire it up, and it's good to go. So I just wanted to show you guys really quick, just so you get an idea of what I'm doing. So let me get all this uh, finished up and cleaned up and we'll test it out and I'll just show you everything one more time. That's it. All right guys, got everything wired up and zip tied down. Um, I'll show you. There's that one. You can see the one over there a little bit. Here's my fat wire mess. 
forgive that light strip there just ran the wire down under um, as far as wiring this up if you can see that black wire right here it's this bottom right corner pin that's a ground and then this red wire is tapped into this far gray uh, plug right here the bottom uh, the bottom right hand corner wire it's a thick gray wire you can't really see it let's see let's see if I can get this shit out of the way yeah it's hard to get it but anyways it's this plug and it's the far bottom right hand corner on that plug it's a um, kind of a th little bit thicker gray wire and I just used one of those little uh, wire tap things and put the red wire to that and what that does is every time these dome lights are on um, these footwell lights will come on um, and then there's an app that's on the phone uh, let's see it's called I don't know if you can see that LED lamp change it to uh, scanning it says tap pink uh, I missed it okay it's not connected yet I guess let's see The scanning. It's supposed to have a device up here. Yes, yeah, so there's no devices found. What the hell? Shaking it. <laughs> All right, so if we change it to pink, oh, I guess that's red. Green, blue, that one's like really dim, I don't know why that's so, yellow, you know, all kinds of different custom colors. So anyways, yeah, you can kind of play around with that, um, it's got basically got all kinds of colors RGB so probably different probably millions of colors you can choose from so anyways I'm going to just clean this little bit of a mess up but uh, that does it for this video uh, if you guys like the content please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one thanks